Hi friends, it's Andy. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to yet another unboxing of my Sips by subscription. This is going to be my January box. I missed sharing my December box with you all because I was oh, so very sick. <laughs> it just was not going to happen. But I wanted to share the January box with you. And while I do that, um, just because the cough seems to be the thing that I am having the hardest time knocking, I'm going to have some tea. Um, and the tea I'm having is from the December box. It's called Happy Tea from YourTea.com. And it's um, kind of like an herbal tea uh, that is for uh, kind of like a, a stress and anxiety uh, type of uh, combination of herbs to address that specific reason. Um, I've also found that uh, I really like the taste of it and it's it's a very light type of tea but it also gives you like a little boost of energy um, as well um, that I really like. It just kind of gives you a boost of energy and a boost in your mood. Um, I do have the windows open so you may hear some background noise as far as like the blinds moving or people talking or walking by my apartment. Um, but it's a beautiful day outside. It's like 55 degrees. It's cloudy, like heavily cloudy, which is why we're working with artificial light. <laughs> and um, yeah, it's, uh, we don't get very many days like this here in Arizona. We don't get a lot of quote unquote type of like weather. Um, it's supposed to rain at some point today. I don't know if that's gonna happen. But it's just, it's a really beautiful day as far as the temperature goes. So I've got everything open to air out the apartment. Um, anyway, back to Sips by, let me get some tea because. Oh, Nelly, that's a little hot. Oh, but it feels so good on my throat. Anyway, let's get into the January box. I hope I'm in frame. Am I in frame? I'm in frame. I moved the position of the camera uh, just a little bit um, to allow myself a little bit more room within the frame. So let me know if this angle is okay for you. All right, so the first thing that happens when you open the box is you get a little information card that tells you about all the different teas that were selected um, specifically for you. Each box is curated based on your tastes and the more you review the teas that they send to you, the better they're able to curate the box. So this is um, made for me and Let's see, they pick four different teas and you get four servings of each one. Sometimes they'll give you loose teas. If they do, they do provide you with the little disposable tea bags or um, I don't think I got anything like that in this box. No, that's cool. Um, I did end up going to Ikea with my family, I believe last weekend because my sister needed something for her apartment. And my dad and my stepmom got me a tea infuser um, that I could put into my teacup for the loose leaf teas. And I love it. Um, so uh, sometimes I use that. Sometimes I use the little baggies that they send to you. In this box, I got yet another pumpkin spice tea. This is a uh, pumpkin spice by Ticino, I think it's pronounced that way. And it is organic roasted carob, organic barley and chicory, dates, almonds, natural pumpkin spice flavor, organic cinnamon, nutmeg, and organic ginger and cloves. Ginger is 
really good to have in your teas, by the way. When I was sick, I was, I'm filming, Isabel. Oh, good Lord. She's mad because I'm not paying attention to her at the moment. Um, when I was sick, my grandma suggested ginger. It's a good boost for your immune system, just an FYI. Uh, she's, what did she suggest? She made me grab the ingredients and make a tea of cinnamon, star anise, ginger, lemon peel, and orange peel. And that really helped with my horrible cold that I had and actually helped improve um, the chest cold that I was getting. Um, but anyway, back to this one. This one's pumpkin spice. It's caffeine free. The last pumpkin spice one that I had, which was by the Republic of Tea, that one had a medium caffeine level, but this one does not have any caffeine. And it says this blend will satisfy your craving for a pumpkin spice coffee, but without the caffeine or acidity. Enjoy this seasonal flavor as you celebrate the holidays with families, family and friends. And then they also give you um, a or information on how to claim an offer for a discount on the tea should you like it to buy a full box. And that one looks like, here we are. So this is the tea um, from Ticino. So I'm gonna put that back in here. The second tea that they selected for me is called Super Irish Breakfast by Stash Tea. This one is high caffeine. It's a blended black tea. Mm. It cooled off just a little bit. It's not so hot now. Um, this is high caffeine and it says the Irish like their tea brewed very strong. This Super Irish Breakfast Blend is truly the espresso of teas. This tea is delicious with milk and sugar or plain for a brisk cup. I do like my breakfast teas and my chai teas with a little bit of half and half or milk, depending on what I have. Um, and I don't use sugar. I use either agave or I use stevia. Um, but I'm looking forward to this one because I do enjoy a good breakfast tea. And that one looks like this. And then, sorry if there's a glare. Again, we're using artificial light because it's super overcast outside. Um, the third tea is Raspberry and Pomegranate by Ahmad Tea. Now, the last breakfast tea that I showed you all was in my November box, and that was from Ahmad Tea. I really enjoyed that one. Um, so I'm interested to see what this is going to be like. And it looks like this. It's a green tea. Just a little fact about me. I don't like to drink my green tea hot. Um, I like to drink it ice cold. So I will brew this and then probably serve it over ice, especially if it has like a fruity taste to it. I don't like fruity tasting hot teas. It has to be iced. Um, so this is green tea with raspberry and pomegranate fruit pieces. Whoa, that's a wild breeze that's moving my blinds. Um, it is medium caffeine. Sorry, I got distracted. Uh, medium caffeine. And it says here, Ahmad Tea is a British family business with a long tradition. They supply tea for the royal collection, including Buckingham Palace. This tea is delicious, hot, or iced. I will be having it iced. And then the last tea is this one. And this is by the Republic of Tea. It is vanilla apple hibiscus. What an interesting combination. I would not have thought to combine hibiscus with apple. We'll see how it goes. Um, but this is hibiscus, rose hips, apple bits, stevia leaf. Ooh, maybe I don't even, probably won't even have to sweeten it. Uh, natural vanilla and apple flavors. It is caffeine free. And it says, 
Apple pie is proof that apples and vanilla make an enticing duo. I would agree with that. These are blended with exotic Nigerian hibiscus along with lively rose hips to create this aromatic, uplifting herbal tea. I'm sure. However, my hibiscus tea, I like to drink ice cold, so I'll probably do that with this as well. And that is it. Those are the four different teas. Let me show you again. Here are the four um, different teas that I received in my January um, Sips by subscription box. Um, this, by the way, I forgot to say it in the beginning. Oh, Lordy, it's been a while since I made videos. Um, this is not a sponsored video. I do pay for my subscription. I started it in November as a treat to myself for my birthday. And I've been continuing it because I've been really enjoying the subscription box. So, yeah, the referral link that I have that anybody that subscribes to the box gets, uh, the referral link that I have is going to be in the description box. If you want to go ahead and check out Sip Spy, um, you can click on my referral link and uh, all the information on how to sign up for it will or can be accessed from there. Um, I'm interested to see how I'm going to like the teas that they've selected for me. So far, I think the lowest rated tea was like a three star, and then a lot of them have either been a four or five stars. I forgot to take the tea bag out, hold on. Um, but I've been really enjoying the teas uh, that I've received so far. And I think I've purchased two of the teas that I've tried. I've purchased full boxes of them because I really, really enjoy them. Uh, which was the, uh, sorry I shook the camera, which was the Pumpkin Spice Tea by the Republic of Tea and the Mango Moringa Tea Um uh, that came that one came in my December box I'll try to insert a picture here of what it looks like I really love it and Moringa it happens to be a very um, uh, what am I trying to say it's like a superfood so it's really good for you and it's an herbal tea it's caffeine free and it works really well for anxiety it seems to be an ongoing theme for me. Um, it works really well for anxiety, but it also really works well like if you're having stomach issues or uh, to all of my lady friends that still deal with Shark Week, it's really good for cramps. Um, and it's also really good for just your overall gut health. Your immune system lives in your gut, so take care of it. Um, so yeah, the mango moring moringa tea is so good. You don't even have to sweeten it. Um, and I drink that one. That's one of the few fruity teas that I will drink hot. Um, because the mango is just like a hint of the flavor. Anyway, um, that's it for the unboxing. And I hope that you enjoyed it. I'll definitely let you guys know um, by the end of the month what I thought about the teas that they selected for me or the ones that I've managed to try before the end of the month. I'll let you guys know when I do my flip through in my bullet journal for January since I am keeping track of my ratings for the different teas in my bullet journal. Um, but I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll chat with you all down below in the comments. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!